Max Kellerman, what are the chances that your boys win this series? 40%, something like that. <laughs> They're on the road at Cleveland against the best team in baseball. Cleveland outscored their opponents by a greater margin, a much greater margin than anyone else in baseball. Second was the Yankees, just ahead of the Astros, incidentally. The Indians have Corey Kluber, the best pitcher in the American League, going on his regular rest. The reason Terry Francona, the best manager in the game, didn't start Kluber in game one is because if there was a game five, he wanted Kluber on regular rest. Guess what? There's a game five, and Kluber takes the ball with his regular rest, the best pitcher in the league, against CC Sabathia, who's been excellent for the Yankees in the second half of this season. And he's an experienced postseason pitcher, but he's not as good as Kluber. I know the Yankees hit Kluber very well. I'm hoping they do it again. The problem, Stephen A., is this. When you're playing the best team in baseball, which the Yankees are, and they're the second best, the underlying stats say that, um, when that happens, you need to get a little lucky. The J Yankees got lucky a little bit yesterday with all the errors Cleveland made. That's unlike them. They're usually a very good defensive team, and usually defense plays in the postseason. So they got a little lucky. But what's impossible to overcome practically is when you shoot yourself in the foot. Girardi not challenging strike three, which would have ended that inning, the series would already be over most likely. So not only are the Yankees trying to overcome the best team in baseball on the road with their best pitcher, who's also the best pitcher in the league on regular rest, not only do they need some luck to do it, and they don't have their best pitcher going, but they also have to overcome their own gaff by handing game two to Cleveland. It's a lot. I'd say it's 60-40 Cleveland right now. You're unbelievable. That Spot Kellerman is at it again, you know, trying to be Sounds all non-emotional. I mean, where's the love for the New York Yankees? Where's the faith? Where's where, where's that dude at? I mean, you, you're just abandoning them as far as I'm concerned. You jumped ship. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sir, listen, here's the bottom line. If, Re if Joe Girardi had challenged that call, they probably would have won game two, yes. But they might have turned around and lost game three or four in New York because Terry Francona being the extraordinary manager that he is with their personnel, they may have found a way to win the game. I thought it was destined to be a five-game series. I'm not shocked that we're here right now. I can understand those who would say that the Cleveland Indians are the favorites. I'm not going there. I'm going to believe that CC Sabathia is going to show up. I hope he eats about three bowls of crunch berries because the big CC Sabathia infected by sugar is better than the dude that's trying to be some down some type of health nut okay losing weight and not pitching well no i want the, i want the big cc just like i loved big luther just like i loved oprah when she was bigger i want cc sabathia bigger okay <laughs> I mean, that's who i want on now and, and, and right he's there that. and he's there no, no 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 let me tell you let me finish he so he's there kluber i know kluber's a stud probably the al Cy young award would i get it but damn it if he had one good one bad night he could have two even though it's highly unlikely damn it i'm rolling with the yankees aaron judge Two out, two run double. You got you, you sit up there and you look at him with Frazier. Did the same thing. All I'm trying to say to you is that they're getting a the level of production from an abundance of dudes. It's Sanchez one minute. It's Aaron Judge another. By the way, striking out nine times, you know, being out 0 for 11. About three or four of those third strike calls against Aaron Judge was bogus as far as I'm concerned. So there's hope that he might show up in this particular game as well. Sanchez, Frazier, the Gr Gregorius, the crew. I, I, listen, I'm not losing faith. Dylan Patances has me worried. I'm very disgusted with him, but Conley has shown up. Severino okay? had a nice bounce back. Severino showed up seven in and striking out nine. Listen, there is reason to be optimistic because the pressure is on the Cleveland Indians. The Yankees are ahead of schedule. They're playing with house money, and I'm going to roll with the Yankees. I'm going to go things. down with the ship. I'm not going to sit up here and say, well, 40% chance like Spock Kellerman is all He's of a sudden scared, throwing Stephen his fandom He's to the side. Scared. Two Throwing things. His two, to the two things. Uh, remember when we were arguing about what's a bigger concern, Chris Sale struggling or Aaron Judge struggling? They both continued to struggle. The Yankees are still playing. The Red Sox went home. That's point number one, Stephen A. I isn't that what happened? What do you mean? I don't understand. Well, you don't your remember point. that argument, do you? you <laughs> no, no, I'm saying I don't. I, I, don't, I, don't I don't comprehend your point. Is what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, it, what is it your turns point? Turns out, as usual, the evidence is in, and I was right and you were wrong. That's the point. What, That's what the was big I wrong? What was I wrong about? That's the what headline. was I wrong about? I don't recall the, saying the Red Sox was going to beat the Astros. What was I wrong about? You said, well, we had an argument the other day. Never mind. The people remember. We had an argument the other day. What's a bigger concern? Chris Sale struggling for the Red Sox 
or Aaron Judge struggling for the Yankees, and you said Judge struggling for the Yankees is a bigger concern, mm. and yes. Judge has continued to struggle, and the Yankees are still playing. Yeah, but, 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 but the Red, Sox, the Red, the Red Sox, Sox didn't lose because of sale. The Red Sox, the Red Sox lost because they were an <laughs> inferior team to the Astros. The better team won. You're trying to change the argument. I'm so surprised. <laughs> Now, and and I was right as usual. I'm glad the Yankees you have right. a great the Yankees have a great bullpen. And the Batances thing actually can work in their favor because as you saw with Severino, their two best pitchers actually on one on the staff, one in the pen, when everything is right, is Severino and Batances. Batances has been over the last four years, you know, among the top handful of relief pitchers, period, in baseball. And the fact that he hasn't been himself recently, if Batances can, and that's the way baseball works. Guys go up and down a little mechanical change, and suddenly they're back to themselves. If Batances can become Batances again, the Yankees can make a real run through this postseason. So you started off by saying you give them less than a 50% chance, but I now you're saying out. if Dylan Patances, he if. does this, the Yankees can make a I real one. We're out. talking about t- tomorrow night, Max. Are they going to win tomorrow night? I mean, I if, if they don't do it, Dylan Patances is going to have an a, a off season. What are you talking about? I want to point out to the baseball gods that I am showing humility. I am not p- picking the Yankees to win. 40% chance, baseball gods. I hope I have not angered you. Real and if Stephen A has angered right you, now. please do not take that out on our Yankees. Thank you.